Hello everybody, Jay Barino here. Welcome, thanks for joining me today. I'm going to be starting a new custom campaign showcase for Warcraft 3. This is Matthias Chronicles 1, The Pursuit. So there was an original Matthias Chronicles created by Savage Potato. <clears throat> Med Map Guy, as you know, creator of Joe's Chronicles, and also he remade Shards of Resistance, is doing something similar here where he's remade Matthias Chronicles with permission of the original creator, the Savage Potato. So Med Map Guy has reappeared and has been posting on Hive Workshop. He did make an update to Shards of Resistance, and I'll, some of the minor changes that he made did reflect some of the criticism that I had when I played it, which again, at the time, I realized was an older campaign and was conflicting with a lot of the patch issues, because I'm playing on a newer version of the game. Uh, so I, I don't know if I had any impact on him changing that one or not. It doesn't really matter if it was me or not, but a lot of the stuff that I had issues with um, like some of the broken abilities and, and the, just some of the way that the terrain worked has been updated mildly, which is cool, so I'd, I'd like to go back and play that at some point. But anyway, this is Matthias Chronicles. He has recently updated a version of this. In fact, it was updated uh, just yesterday from when I'm starting recording this. So I think this will be cool, and uh, thanks MedMap Guy for, for coming back and revisiting some of this stuff. A demo of, of this remake has been out for a long time, and then he's come and, uh, and released the whole thing. So I suppose let's get into it now that you've gotten the full context. Follow the tale of Prince Matthias, the illegitimate son of King Terranus, and what happened in the Kingdom of Lordaeron when Arthas did not... It's a... It's a mystery. So this campaign was meant to be played on 1.27, which is before the... the actual widescreen support. But, of course, I'm playing on the PTR, which is 1.31, so we still... We'll probably run into some bugs, and I will keep that in mind, obviously. I could downgrade, though, frankly, I feel like going back to the old stretched widescreen would give me an aneurysm at this point. So let's just play on this as we've been doing. It, again, it may result in some goofiness based on what we can see uh, in, the, in the expanded viewport, uh, which typically happens in the cinematics, and we'll just take that into account as my own problem and not a problem with the, the maps. All right. Survival of the fittest. Let's watch the prologue and get into it. At the dawn of the Third War. So, the the description was slightly cut off, so we'll see if this is, uh, you know, before because Arthas decided not to come back from Lord uh, from, from Northrend or, or something like that. We'll see. <laughs> Clever. Med Map Guy always has made the best cinematics that I've seen in Warcraft 3. The forces of the once mighty Scourge are now scattered and broken amidst the frozen wastes of Northrend. Many weeks have passed since the veterans of that campaign returned, but there is still no news of Prince Arthas. With the Scourge defeated, the Human Alliance turns its attention to other matters. Prince Matthias, the bastard son of King Terranus Manethil II, has been given the command of a small force pursuing a band of orcish refugees fleeing eastward from the camps. Eager to prove himself in the wake of his brother's absence, he has been given the authority to take whatever actions are necessary to resolve the current problem. So this takes place between the first two campaigns of Reign of Chaos. Got it. Matthias chronicles the pursuit, implying that there will be more episodes of this at some point. So it was similar with Shadow, uh, the Raiders, Shadow, what was it called? Shadows of War, the Raiders. We cannot halt the column for long here. It is poor country for foraging and the humans are hard at our heels. Malachi. War Chief, how long must we march at this reckless pace? Our troops are exhausted. We must rest. There are human settlements to the south, War Chief. Perhaps we could seize supplies from them. Maybe if we were a force of your raiders, old friend. But the bulk of this column is made up of the old and infirm, our mates and young ones. Curse the traitor Thrall and his prophecies. If he and that coward Hellscream had not fled to the west in their ships, we would have a force that could stand and fight. I fear that we shall have to make our stand all too soon, Ushkar. Prince Matthias is a superb tactician, but he nurses a deep and abiding hatred for our race. We can expect no quarter from him.
The human nobles speak of honor, chivalry, and nobility. But these are merely words to them. They consider themselves above the laws of the land. But in their hearts, they are no more than butchers. You're saying they don't intend to return us to these camps? I have no doubt of that. Do you remember the smoke columns we saw at the start of our march? Yes, they burn day and night in great numbers. And did you think Hellscream and ours were the only clans interred? There were many, many camps, Ushgar, but I have yet to see a soul from any of the other clans. But they were burning the corpses of the undead. Must you constantly spout the lies of the humans? There cannot have been that many undead in all of creation. Those were the bodies of our brothers and sisters they were burning. We must not let our people fall into the hands of those monsters. Let us send out a rear guard to capture the village and stall our pursuers. Those people we send, Ushgar, you know they will not return. I'm not afraid. Let me lead the rear guard and I will strike down the cursed human prince. I do not doubt your courage, old friend, but I cannot spare you. I can see that I will have need of your axe in the coming days. I obey your orders, War Chief, for now. Send to me the Riders of the Wounded Claw. I have a glorious task for thee. So we're, he's trying to set up perspective from the... I, I, I assume these are supposed to be like Black Rock Clan orcs, essentially, or, or, you know, a member of the, like, Second War Leftovers that didn't go with Thrall. Typically, we consider them, you know, bloodlusted, you know, bad guys. But here, again, they're just trying to, I think anthropomorphize them well that's the wrong word i guess you know humanize them give them more personality uh to make us sort of feel bad for them because lordaeron is essentially committing genocide by putting the orcs into internment camps and then just killing them uh rather than just like keeping them in, in prison is, is the setup here so again rather than having thrall be the only level-headed orc leader we've got these leftovers that typically we just see as bad guys you know now they're uh they're more built up uh, in terms of uh narrative a small force of orcish raiders has been sent westward from the main column. It is ordered to establish a base near the human village of Ranfurly and stall the march of the human forces. Frustrated by the low progress, slow progress of his troops, Matthias marches ahead of the main body of the human army. With the bulk of the his new forces, with the bulk of his new for, with the bulk of his forces strung out on the road behind him, Matthias seeks to draw the orcs into a decisive battle. So I actually presume that we're playing as the sort of baddies here, right? Because we're just trying to hunt down these orcs and murder them straight up. Even though it's mostly old and infirmed people. Destroy the bestiary. Find a location for your base. Matthias and the dwarven transport must survive. It isn't easy being a prince. <laughs> it isn't easy being a prince. Soul Blast. A divine soul blast is cast on an enemy target, causing damage and stunning it. Each targeted unit heals less damage. Oh, okay, so it's a, it's a chain heal. I think we obviously want that. Bonus attack damage. Divinely condemns a creature or building, destroying it utterly. Just a huge nuke. Probably like Finger of Death. Let's go Holy Light. Healing Light. Makes the most sense. And then, and then we'll probably just get one level here because the stun is going to be the most important thing. No one orders me around. I like how his lines are sort of similar to what we would expect from, from Arthas. It's custom, though, and I, I like these uh, these custom, you know, footmen and archers. Very cool. Very good looking. No one orders me it feels like I'm playing on a slower game speed. Is that... What's happened? Let's check. No, we're still on fast game speed. All right. Well, I'm certainly intrigued. No one orders me. Dwarven transport needs to survive. Hopefully stuff doesn't spawn behind me, because otherwise we could just leave it here at the front. But yeah, med map guy... Really well known for having really cool looking cinematics, which we've clearly seen. No one orders me around. At last. Oh, we're going into like a swamp. Excellent. Certainly. Excellent. And having pretty engaging Certainly. narratives. 
at last. Is that and also utilizing a lot of cool custom Certainly. assets. So I'm very, very excited to get it into this. And again, it's, it's relatively new Excellent. with when it's been released. So we'll see what we got. Crocolisk Whelp. Let's just hotkey this and make sure that it stays relatively close to us. No one Healing Light. 90 mana. Being, Prince. Certainly. Excellent. No trespassing. Well, I am the prince. Certain. So how about... Is that all? I'm going to guess that we're... Excellent. Yeah, it's just supposed to keep us out of there until later when we'll get an optional objective maybe to go in there. Oh, there's no optional objectives. Okay. Mysteries in the upper left. These hills are patrolled by forest trolls. No doubt they are in league with the orcs. Slay them in my name. That's right. Being, uh, being lore accurate by giving them forest trolls instead of uh, dark spear trolls. Troll incursion. And they, they think they've won the war with the undead. They're all just blissfully unaware that Arthas is going to come back and wreck their shit. I like how his hammer is on fire, looks like it. Healing salve. Everything's, it seems like we're like, again, it might just be because, again, the aspect ratio, but everything is slightly smaller. Okay, no defense. Eventually we can get Searing Arrows. Adds 10 bonus damage, that's huge. No one clarity, that's around. good. Why not? Well, that's fine. Healing salve is nice as well. Is that all? Is that all? Certainly. So let's just is explore. Excellent. We're definitely going to run into all? this this rear guard of orcs. I will save Lord Ron at any cost. At last. <laughs> where is Certainly. this? Where are these voice lines it from? It sounds easy. very similar to Arthas, but it's a different at different last. voice acting. It seems like. Hello, my friend. It's Prince, it's Prince Matthias and the Royal Guard. Is that all? Prince Matthias, you honor this old man with your presence. What brings you back to these lands? Ah, okay. Interesting. I've reason to believe that an orcish force may have established an outpost near this village. Impossible. In these lands? I assure you, this threat is very real. If you're anything to report, come to me at once. Let's ask about the mayor. Hmm, okay. He doesn't like the mayor. He doesn't want to talk about him. Is it true your brother has yet to return from his expedition in the north? I am not my brother's minder, old man. Do not speak of him again. Ooh, jealousy. Town mayor? No. It's fine. Before you take your leave, my prince, Lady Dinesha's child has gone missing. Rumor has it that forest trolls are behind the kidnapping. Perhaps you could look for him and look into this matter. I shall look into it. Very atmospheric music. I like it. Speak, servant. Rescue the kidnapped child. Think it's going to ping me where he is? Excellent. Let's go down here. It is. It is going to ping me where he is. Certainly. And it's down in this At general last. vicinity where I'd expect him to be. Help us find our child. I will save Lord Ron at any cost. Is that all? I recognize the voice At actor. Last. Excellent. I definitely re I recognize the voice actor. So At I just last. oh this is the this is, he's back here. Well, it's a good thing we heeded the keep out sign. All right, let's backtrack and do this real quick. Okay, I, I definitely, I, it's, it's, it's a voice actor from something professional, but I'm not sure. It's not, it's not coming to mind. Where the, like, where, what the actual, uh, Excellent. oh, there's some crates up here. Death has no sting. It's Artanis' voice actor, die. right? That's where I recognize it from. It's Artanis from Legacy Certain. of the Void. At last. But when did he Excellent. record voice lines for something from... Certainly. Warcraft 3, Excellent. specifically someone from Lordaeron. Speak, servant. Certainly. Maybe it's from Worlds of Warcraft? But why would they say, I will save Lordaeron at any cost, when Lordaeron has been destroyed at that point? Is that all? Maybe Certainly. it's from Heroes of the Storm? Maybe, maybe it's Arthas and Heroes of the Storm. 
I uh, I don't know. Someone, I'm sure one of you knows, so fill me in rather than me just constantly talking about this over and over again. Excellent. All right, let's get in here. Certainly. Get this Excellent. keep out shit out of here. Let's not block. Interestingly, if you the the, the music changed. Burn and slaughter every troll you see. Can he heal himself? Sure can. That's cool looking. Like it's not it's not chain heal directly. It isn't easy, Certainly. At last. Excellent. Kill the troll warlord. Alright, I got it. Lots of inner fires as well. Alright, level two. I would I think let's just go to grab Soul Blast. Oh, well, wasn't paying attention. Lost that guy. Soul Blast is B. Lost another guy. Good thing that these other guys are behind my, my ranged guys. Very sloppy. Very sloppy, but it's okay. These guys are going to be out of mana here pretty soon. Heal yourself, and then there's a Rune of Restoration there. We'll just pick it up. Try to finish him up. Whoa, what the heck was that? It's over, fiend. I've slaughtered your er entire village. Return the boy, and I'll grant you a quick death. I know who you after, and you be too late. The war chief already left this land, and the villagers be just a distraction from your pursuit. Enough with your lies, beast. Think what you will, but know this, human. The, hu the villagers' greed be leading them to collaborate with the orcs. Still your lying tongue. My subjects would never trade with the orcs. Perhaps they do not love you as much as you think, little prince. Look to their storehouse to reveal their treachery. Okay. Child is back. He's got something something going on with him, but that's alright. He's fine. Man, I, I lost two units there. That was a real messy. Can I see some chests? Those blend in. I'm going to be missing those sometimes. Guaranteed. Excellent. Amulet of Zulaman increases armor by four, strength by three, and grants the ability to immolate. That's great. Certainly. That's actually that really, all? really good. Okay, let's get out of here. Excellent. At last. We want to go check out the storehouse, apparently. It's this. Certainly. This entire city. He's gonna he's gonna break the crates and realize they're working with the orcs, and then this entire city must be purged. You know how it goes. Take Johnny back to the village. There's nothing here that says that I have to inspect the the storehouse. I think it's cool though that we are supposed to. All right, it's a, again, it's like it's not necessarily an objective, but we can, and it will give us some sort of narrative payoff. I think that's neat. And by narrative payoff, it's going to be this crazy guy. I will say uh, he's going to be like, let's kill everybody here. Cost. That you know, that's what it's going to be. Who are you? No one orders me around. Excellent. All right. So here's the storehouse. At last. Certainly. Maybe it's this. Living by a swamp has its advantages. Excellent. For one, it's okay. Maybe there's At none. Last. <laughs> Good day, my lord. Certainly. At last. All right. So where were the people? I think they they were down here, right? So here's. Hello. He's back. It's fine. Mommy, daddy. Johnny, thank the gods. I told you not to wander off. Katriana. How can we ever repay you for your bravery? You might want to show me what you're hiding in that storehouse behind you. This is a main objective, so I guess technically this we had to do this. My lord, all we have in there are supplies for the winter. I would think that there would be precious few supplies left since you traded them with the orcs. No, my lord, it's not like that at all. The orcs were holding my son hostage. They said if we wouldn't sell our goods to them, they would kill him. Sell goods? I risk my life to free your son and you sell goods to my enemies? It's not what you think, my lord. They took the goods by force, but their leader insisted that they pay for everything they took. See, the orcs are like benevolent and our guy's just an asshole. Insolent peasant, I don't take betrayal lightly. Burn the storehouse down. Take what you can from the ashes. These louts shall not enjoy the fruits of their treachery.
How are we going to get anything out of it if it's burned down? You got to go in, take the stuff out, then burn it down. Okay. Let's see if it if it takes time to burn down. I will save Lord Ron at any cost. These guys now will let us through. Is Let's explore all? if there's anything else to explore Attack. in the town. What will we do now? We'll starve. Certainly. At last. Get Ed out of the way. I, no one orders me around. Is that well, all? we've doomed the village. And we've explored it all, I think. It looks like it's larger, but we can only path through a certain amount Certainly. of it. Excellent. Sire, Certainly. how could you? It isn't easy being prince. It isn't easy being prince. You heard him. Is that all? I mean, this is similar At to last. the story we saw in Shadows. Excellent. Is it, I get, no is it Shadows of War? I just remember it's called the Raiders, where again the orcs that they're on Lordaeron again, as we know, as we've known them in the past, they're just sort of um, warmongering dickheads. But now you know you, you turn the tables, and they turn out that it turns out that they're benevolent and and kind and helpful, and just trying to survive. So it's kind of you know re redefining them a little bit. Back these guys out. Just let Matthias take the the heat. We can do our chain heal after all this. Let's focus on the level six, please. No one orders me around. The the um, the arrow shot sound is uh, was used also in Shadows of War, and I I do quite like it. Was it used in something else? Med Map Guy did too. I don't know, but I like the I like the differing sounds that were used. Ogres. Okay, Fountain of Health. This will be worth it, I think. Healing light. No, it's uh, blast. Soul blast. Bam. Whew. No joke. Okay, very nice. The Immolation Aura is certainly nice. It's, you know, it's doing mild damage. And then we can sit here and get healed up. It isn't easy being Prince. Is that all? But I also like how, again, we're playing as kind of the, the dickhead guy rather than the orcs. But this was similar to what we saw in, in uh, the Raiders where, as well, no where like sometimes we played as the orcs now. and sometimes we played as the the xenophobic guy Excellent. who ended up betraying them all. At last. Didn't he? I think it was. Yeah, Is he betrayed all? Kobayashi, didn't he? At the end, where he like ran away, he could have helped him. Anyway, let's move forward. And I haven't used any of my consumables. Classic, too good to Speed use. Jay Barino, letting two of his guys die. Though to be fair, I was looking at uh, at my abilities at the time. The glaring ahead would make an excellent site for a base. Move the dwarven transports near the gold mine. Well, we only have one. Certainly. I think we're gonna have some Blast. different type of. Uh, I see a little railroad track. Excellent. I wonder if there's going to be some sort of different mechanic here Blast. for how this works. It isn't easy being Two gold mines. Huh. Okay. Get get yes, working. And then this one. I like the look of our workers. Okay, so now we're going. We have an altar now, so we're not at risk of losing if this guy dies. And we can continue moving out and looking for stuff. Reinforcements have arrived. Certain buildings can be entered by units. If movement is an issue with the structure, use attack move to get around. No one orders me around. Okay. Excellent. Does that mean we can go in this? At last. Ah, okay. Is that all? Pendant of mana, that's great. Maybe I should have gone into this and I could have, because we saw that there were things inside of it. I'll backtrack and try it. That's clever. Okay, so we need farms. More farms. So let's go, uh, you know, farm, farm. Okay, that's our barracks. Looks good. And then we'll get a lumber mill over here. Mm, down here. Anywhere down here is fine. I do. Interesting. It isn't easy being free. So let's see if we can go in here. He said that we could, you know, take what we needed. I do like also how it's clear, like, if movement is an issue, you can, you know, do this other thing to get through. I appreciate the, the tips. Alright, so we can make a barracks, a church. That's that's very Warcraft Warcraft one. 
workshop. So we have access to a lot of stuff here. Like, our tech tree is pretty built up. Well, easy. Let's just get more farms. All right. Ready to work. We're just going to get a ton of guys on lumber. This is being built. I guess let's no just go ahead and keep, just keep going through the forest. We just have to get to the upper left eventually. If we lose these guys, that's really not the end of the world because I can rebuild stuff now. Archer, rifleman, what's the difference? Evasion is nice. Oh, searing arrows. I think that archers probably are going to do more damage in the long run. Seems like our, yeah, our workers are getting things going here. Let's quickly build the lumber mill. No one orders me around. Okay, that's the other side of the Excellent. city. I like the freedom that we have on this map. Damn it, an orcish scouting party has detected us. Brace for an attack. At last. Okay, well, we'll scout eventually. Let's just come back here and just build more stuff. Footman, yeah, that's that's the normal cost. Let's finish this quickly. I'm just gonna get my economy like 100% settled and then we can go from there. Just keep making farms. Then we can get our keep. And that's all I can do now until, again, we just need, we always need a lot of guys on lumber. Can I make towers? Yes, I can. I don't want to overbuild towers, though, so let's not go crazy with them. We'll just get, like, one or two of them. You know they've got to be symmetrical, or right? at least make an attempt to do it. What is... Why, what are you doing here? All of you, I want you returning to the lumber mill. Uh, okay, so let's get these fully saturated now. And then we'll go keep. And interestingly enough, like, you kind of have to think about your peon train, peasant train, because this is further away. Can get in there? Guard towers only. These are raiders. The siege damage is going to do well for us. What do I need to get searing arrows, I wonder? Oh, that's not my guy. <laughs> Hit him from the heavens! <laughs> Finally, Lord Duncan and his knights have arrived. Oh, these guys have been back here the whole time. Move up, and then I've got Lord Duncan, who's a paladin. Righteous Fury! Warrior, hero, and leader of an order of knights. Exceptional at augmenting nearby friendly troops can learn... F yeah, okay. Devotion aura is fine. Holy Water Bomb. Decreases armor, deals high damage over time. Job's done. Five max damage per second, reduces armor by three. We got a double stun here. Let's just go Devotion, devotion Aura to start. Upgrade complete. And then we'll move these guys up. No Heal yourself. Interesting. Extremely interesting start. Let me say. Let me say. We need more farms. Getting free guys certainly makes you know the base building of this a little less tedious to start. You can get in this gold mine, and I think what I'd like to do is just uh, let's get going here pretty soon. Book of Holy Light reduces spell damage by 33% and increases mana. Does it have spells in it? It says left click to use. Again, that may very well be a an issue with the patch version that I'm on, though I don't know. Once this guy makes it up, we'll go ahead and continue moving through. And having the knights will help a lot. This is a lot of frontline stuff, and I can't even make a blacksmith yet, can I? Clerics and swordsmen. Can't make swordsmen. I can only make footmen. Okay, well, this is a seemingly a strong force, so let's move on up and continue looking through the forest. Okay, there's a lot of area to explore through here. That's blocked. Can't get through there if I wanted to. Is that all? Certainly. I am not afraid. What do we got here? Just orcs? All right, we found their the entrance to their base, it seems. Speak, servant. Yes, my lord. Can we get up here? No. Command me. Yeah, okay, there's a lot of map to explore here. We can get these heroes leveled up. That would make me feel yes, yes, a little better because they're they're pretty weak right now. Lord Duncan, get up there. See, we could give him a stun as well. I think we'll go actually holy water bomb for some AOE whatever. These wooden chests, I'm going to miss a bunch of them. Guaranteed. It is called Matthias Chronicles, so I will probably... Oh, oh my god. Oh, I think that was there the whole time. 
Increases agility and intelligence by three. We're just gonna stack up stuff on Matthias. And then we can give Lord Duncan the support type items. No one orders me Whoop, okay, well, let's come back. It shall be done. No one orders me around. Gloves of greater Is attack. Okay, plus five claws. Certainly. Get him, Mr. Knight! This is where the raiders are going to do good work. Okay, so we can't build anything more now. Let's go ahead and throw some guys on that gold mine, and let's go to church. This is really more about exploration at this point. Speak, servant. So we just want to make sure we leave some stuff at home. Is my aid required? It isn't easy being prince. Is someone injured? It isn't Excellent. easy being prince. Let's come up here. Go check it's it out, cleric. So they have dispel magic. What ails? Strictly humans, no right elves. Away. It seems like. Of course. And I don't need to be. Expo I could just go for the win. We're just going to keep getting attacked servant. by these guys if I don't. Is that all? If I don't move out here relatively yes, soon. My yes, my liege. Command me. Bring Lord these guys up here. We still need a solid Lord. forward Save fighting force. Lord. Reinforcements have arrived. Again, the fact that we're getting free stuff is really, really nice. Just because I like, I, I'm enjoying being able to explore a little bit around this. And and kind of test the new tech tree to see what it's all about. So not having, you know, not having to tediously build too much and focus on macro it allows me to play around with the heroes a little bit more i love this ability i love the giant lightning bolts it's very satisfying what i would really like is a blacksmith so that i can get some upgrades the buildable terrain is a little wonky yes below Put you guys in the back, you guys in the front. I could just turn formations back on, but it is a pathing nightmare to do that. I definitely don't need more. I definitely don't need more gold. Excellent. Troll incursion. Again, let's just explore the map. Obviously, we just have to get to the upper left, but why don't we? Why don't we just go around and see what we can find? Find what we can find. Voodoo doll is plus one. Unless it's been changed, it's just plus one something. Save Lord Ron at any cost. Suffer and die. So we're getting some more swordsmen, that's great. Better footmen. Then we can come in here and no break these. Me around. It isn't easy being prince. Oop. Break. Certainly. Break. Save Lord Ron at any oh gosh. Cost. Okay, so Tomo's strength and then Blackthorn's spurs. No one orders me around. I'll do some item management later on. Strength. By three and okay, yeah, these are good items. These are definitely. I mean, these are great. I think we'll be fine here. You finish that and then finish that farm. I mean, we have an A tower, so why don't we just back up a little bit? Okay, looking good. No one orders me around. Guess we'll pick up the voodoo doll, even though it's kind of silly. Oh! Causes the hero's attacks to steal life. It is better. Alright, let's grab a holy water bomb. And we'll come up here if we can fit through here. And then we have this army that's gonna sit back here. It looks like this might just circle around through the woods. I like this a lot. I mean, the, the pathways, it's a little hard to see. We are in a swamp. But I, I like, again, that you, you're really rewarded for just exploring off the beaten path. Wait, there's no point. I mean, we don't have to go through here, per se. But the rewards are quite nice. And this is something I'm learning as I'm playing, like, Red Alert 2, for example. Like, I, I complain that there's, you know, there's so much of the map that's unused. But if you explore, there's a lot of good stuff that you can utilize by doing that. Okay, we have more than enough of an, an army to... More work. Off I go, then. To move out and take care of uh, the orcs, I think. So we've got our church. Out of training will give us dispel magic. Blacksmith. There's searing arrows. And let's just get all of these. Let's just get everything. Let's do it. Who got left behind? No one orders me around. No one At orders me around. It shall be done. And there's still a lot of the map that oh, we can explore here. 
What if we auto attack to like the bottom left, for example? Let's see which direction we end up going. I'm taking very long on this mission, but that's because I want to take the time to actually look. The terrain looks great, by the way. Like the different tree models are a nice touch. It's a very, very good looking swamp. And like the the pathways are a little tight, but not agonizingly small. Oh, we got some mortar teams. Cool. Okay, well, that'll be helpful. Don't need to use that right now. I am getting just some... I might be capped at level 2. I'm not sure. You stuck? You're stuck. Okay, well, don't go that way, then. Come down and around this way. Okay, and we're running... Yes, flank him! Get him! Cleric, no! Their hero has a stun of some si of some sort. What was his name? Gorehound. Alright, looking good. And then our heroes are coming around the other way. Or is our hero... Yeah, our hero's actually in there. Holy water ba... Oh, never mind. <laughs> I'd like to go and find, yeah, where the orcs are coming from so that we can get this show on the road now. Plus two is available. Uh, let's bring everybody, since we're going to cut off their attacking force for sure, if we continue doing this. That's a cool-looking chain heal. Alright, here we are. Get in there. I have mortar teams, so we're going to focus down these. Uh, they're heavy armor, so it's not like they're going to take additional damage. Uh, I never got to fend. That would have been useful. Okay, we've got plenty of reinforcements coming in. They do have a good amount of towers, but we should be okay. Focus down these and then the burrows. Those are also heavy armor. Look out, Mr. Knight. Holy Water Bomb is W. Why don't we clump up a little bit and then we can use some of these consumables. Now, buddy. Nice is a coward, just sitting in the back. Alright, we seemingly have, have won. Not sure if this will be the end or not. But again, there's a lot of space here that I probably could have continued to explore. It looks like all this up here is not accessible. The beast here is in the far upper right, so this is just the base that's sending attacks. Alright, I guess let's get that workshop. There's so much money. <laughs> So I'm not sure if there's a hard difficulty or not. As typical, I can pick hard difficulty when I open up the custom campaign, but I'm not sure if there's actually a built-in hard difficulty or not. Let's keep wiping this out. Holy water bomb! Okay, these mortar teams are a blessing. Okay, so like if I wanted to come right down away. here, let's see if we can auto attack down there just to see where these guys go. It would may it may not no actually be possible. I like the I like the trick of the I like how the um what am I thinking? I like how the uh, the voodoo doll ended up being like a million times better. Holy water bomb! Well, it looks awesome. It, it really does look sweet. Is this a dead end? Scroller protection. I don't even think I want to divert and bother with that. No one orders me around. Okay, very nice. Here, give him the 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 other clarity pot. This isn't easy being prince. And yeah, we're not getting any. I mean, these, these things give us cash, but that's about it. So like, I, again, I'm checking. I'm like, I'm looking around where possible, but it looks like yeah, I can't get down here, for example. Yes, my friend. Increases strength and armor and allows for bash. Let's go and get that to Matthias. Of course, as you wish. Of course. Definitely good rewards for at least looking around. I appreciate that. As you wish. So see, I, I don't think there's a way to get up here if you if we wanted to. Let's see if these guys will make it. No, there's no there's no way. So that might be actually an area used for cutscenes. It isn't easy being prince. Allows bash, man. A lot of these items are very good. 
Pennant of Mana is excellent just as a base item. I don't necessarily need the Gloves of Greater Attack, but I'm going to give Matthias Lifesteal instead. It's only 25 gold. It must be like a really minimal Lifesteal. I don't know, though. Uh, so we could come up here. This, I mean, this, these both look like entrances into the main base. I think I've explored everything there is to explore, so let's move up and let's check our workshop. Liquid Fire sounds great, and just build a ton of them and run them up here, slowly but surely. No one don't call me Shirley. Let's just go. Let me face the battle. As you I wish, think we'll be okay. It isn't easy being friends. Certainly. Their attacks are actually coming in from this particular location. I just want to look to see if there's anything out here. It doesn't look like it. I like the peon model used. Looks really good. And again, because these are heavy armor, and actually, I mean, we can outrange them. That's the only benefit the mortar teams give us. Alright, there's their altar. Doesn't look like they're rebuilding their hero, unless he's actually still alive somewhere. Holy water bomb! Where is he? Get up there. Their hero just respawned. Weird that he popped out there and not... I, I don't know. Weird. Go for the towers. I like how the towers are surrounded with little fences. And there's the bestiary. I wonder why the bestiary was our main objective. Just keep healing, buddy. Holy water. Oh, never mind. That's fine. They'll all be fine. Get in there, buddy. Okay, and let's check up here, at least. Is that all? Wolves. And we can check up there again. We might as well look. We don't want to kill the bestiary just yet. Pot of greater mana. Don't need it. Looks like, again, there's more areas to look around in, so we might as well check again. And this is kind of... I think this is it. Wolves. Someone in All right, cool. I mean, awesome. I mean, really good intro. Again, I spent way longer on it than necessary, but there's so much cool stuff that we all track Swiss cheese. No, 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 I need it. Maybe he got it while slightly off camera. I hadn't been saving. It would take me a while to get back to that. A glorious victory, wouldn't you say, Duncan? Now we must pursue the orcs into the forest before the rest of their ilk get away. Prince Matthias, our troops are spent from the forced march. They have done you proud today. You're right, they are exhausted, but I can't help feel that with every passing hour, the orcs slip further from our grip. You do not think we face their main force, then? Far from it. We must not let them get too far ahead. Tomorrow, send the knights ahead to the river. We will chase the remaining raiders into the forest and wipe them out. Need that Swiss cheese? It's probably an Easter egg item, or it was the best item ever. Alright, you know you boys had to go back to try to get the cheese. So, I have... Oh, slows down enemies that try to smell that Alteracian Swiss fragrance. So, uh, one thing, I found I've, several things. As you can see, I have cheats on right now. I found that... There's a, so much stuff all over the map. Like, I found some stuff. There was, like, something hidden behind trees down here. There were crates, so many crates hidden all over the place. I see an attack going from my base, so let's just turn this back on. Uh, there, And there's so many crates, I found a, a couple extra tomes and a bunch of different items no so that these heroes are both totally loaded up. So we still have the Mantle of Grace, the Axe Grinder, the fact that it grants Bash is nice. This is plus five attack. This is just plus one strength and armor, I think. As you wish. So we could drop that, and I'll put. I'll give him the cheese. Increases the strength by four and deals slow damage when held. I like that quite a bit, so we'll take that. And then I found out that this group of wolves actually grants a random item. So they dropped some decent stuff. One thing was like plus 10 damage and plus three strength, which seemed like the best thing. But this is the first time I could get the cheese to drop. I just wanted to see what it did. And this actually seems, seems great, the fact that it deals slow damage. Though that may conflict with the fact that we have a, a bash. Because, uh, again, some of this stuff is only, I, have, I assume, is an orb effect. So, like, this guy, we've got um, 
Bash, but then we've also got Lifesteal. So these two may actually conflict. Uh, the Voodoo Doll, and I don't know how much Lifesteal it actually gives, but I, I would prefer to take the the Lifesteal on At him. Your call. Um, and uh, otherwise, I think this guy, the Bash here, may conflict with the Ultra X Swiss Cheese. So we probably want to get rid of the Axe no Grinder and the Shield around. Basher over time. I am not. Um, but anyway, now we've got the cheese. We're going into next mission fully stacked. Uh, one nice thing that I found was this uh, this gem of greater strength. The life bonus is pretty significant. It's 250 HP, which I think is Khadgar's gem of health. And otherwise, I think, again, we're totally stacked. Again, I'm a little confused about the voodoo doll considering it's valued so low, but attacks to steal life that's nice and again some of these just there were just barrels just sort of around that i had missed that had lumber in them they had all sorts of stuff so i have to be really really observant and this might be a campaign where every time i finish speak servant uh, a mission or get At close last. to the end i might use the vision sheet just to see what kind of stuff we can find because i'm actually it isn't easy uh, pretty increase. excited again that we got the cheese and uh the 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 Extra, the gloves that we got for the extra damage seemed like they would have been pretty good. But again, as far as I could tell, everything was fixed loot except this group of wolves, which was random. Which is particularly interesting. Okay, so anyway, uh, we'll just go ahead and end the mission again, and it'll be just like, like nothing happened. And we actually had the cheese drop on my initial attempt. I tried, I tried so hard to pick it up in time, but it just wasn't in time. But now we've got it. And we got some extra items as well, so I'm sure we're going to find some really cool stuff over the course of this, uh, over the course of this campaign. And I'll try to do my best to to juggle items and and take what seems to be the best. All right. Well, next time we we'll come back, we'll play Black Powder in the Leaves. Interesting title. And uh, again, this is a longer one, but mostly just because I I wanted to mess around and see what was available to me. It's very similar to the the typical human faction, but. Um, again, there are a nice, nice different options, and all of the skins are great looking. The different, the different portraits, the different skins, and the different uh, sound effects, I, I, are all very welcome. They're all great. So we'll see how this, uh, how this goes as we continue into it, and hopefully we don't run into too many issues because of my refusal to downgrade to 1.27. But in any case, I think we'll be okay for the most part, and I'll see everyone next time. Bye bye.